Hey everyone, it's Amador, and welcome to the Walking You Into Wonderland YouTube Hop. Uh, this was all put together by Tamika, and she is from Scrap the World, and if you guys know, she's super, super awesome and super talented. Um, she was kind enough to invite a few of us here on YouTube to participate in this YouTube Hop. We were to create a Winter Wonderland um, theme project for Christmas, you know, something something different, and for several years, I work at the, I don't know if any, uh, some of you guys might know, I actually work at the Venetian in uh, Las Vegas. And every winter they have a winter in Venice themed whole thing where they arrange the atrium with all of these, you know, holidays or whatever. But for the past few years they've done these giant uh, white peacocks, which I'll admit every year I've actually plotted. I'll sit there and look at them and plot how I could probably sneak one out of the back door, through the hallways, out of the exit, and just throw it in somebody's truck and just take off. Seriously. They're that beautiful. So I figured, hey, you know what? I've always wanted one of these for myself. And I apologize for the angles in advance. I have no conventional way of recording this. Um, you'll see why. It's it's rather of a, a, a different shape. And, um, and yeah, you'll see how, I, like I said, so I apologize if my camera's shaking or anything. But, um, so, so anyhow... Uh, you guys just probably came here from T Tamika Scrap the World YouTube, and so uh, Amador Arrows. The next one will be Sweet Crafty Chick, Shantae, um, Tammy from SS Crafter One, Proud Mommy Seven O Two. By the way, I love you, and um, <laughs> sorry for the goose chase. You guys, sorry, inside joke. Anyway, and also So Good All and Luisa Diaz, and the last one will be Gem Sizzle. So Tamika, I know Tamika is doing a giveaway. I will also be doing a giveaway. Some of the accent pieces that I used on my project are from um, the One Little Dreamer Zibit Shop. So I'll be doing a... Just make sure that you guys subscribe to all of the awesome, talented ladies here on YouTube. You guys, they are awesome. They work very hard to create things and make the world just a little bit more beautiful with a little bit of crafting. The, the um, giveaway will close on the 13th and the winner will be announced on the 14th. Okay, so let me show you what I used. What you're looking at right now is the body of my project. Sorry for the shadows. And you'll see that there is quite a bit of um, homemade shimmer spray that I made. I just wanted to use this champagne color from Stampin' Up. I think it's retired. But anyhow, let me show you what I used. This you'll see later on in the project. And I used the um, coffee filters and I folded them twice. And then I ran them through the um, Tim Holtz Tatter Doily. And I used those for the bottom part. Now for what you're looking at right now, this is what I used. These are from the Ink Desk. Um, die also from Tim Holtz and this one is the movers and shapers one so what I used was the feather and yes every single feather I didn't count them the large ones for the body that you're looking at right now and you'll see the top part with the small feathers I hand glued every single one on here you guys I am nuts and you'll only see one project one side of the project but the whole thing is completely completely covered with these feathers and then completely shimmer sprayed my floor looks like it snowed because of all the shimmer spray that ended up on the floor. So anyhow, let me move around and I will also move back and show you guys again what I created. I mean, get you a better look at what I created. See here you can see the shimmer spray. absolutely love this. And it's like a paint. So okay, so let me pull back. I'm sorry for the shadows, like I said, you guys. This is what I created. I created my Winter Wonderland Peacock. I used a spray of pearls that I got from Hobby Lobby. And this is a gem. It's like um, a Christmas tree ornament that had this silver metal filigree on it. And the that's just a ribbon buckle with a pearl um, center. But as you can see, every single feather, you guys, right there. Crazy. Now, if you cut open my poor little peacock... Um, and this is also a trim, this pearl and rhinestone trim. This thing is amazing. It's about an inch wide from One Little Dreamer. But look at that, you guys. Oh, my goodness. I hope you guys <laughs> hope you guys like my craziness. So, um, if you like I said, if I cut open my little peacock, poor guy, I don't know why you would. But it is basically uh, cardboard, bubble wrap, and all of the masking tape. All of, not masking tape, all of the packing tape that I had. I ran out of it. So let me pull back, and I also made a little banner, which I wanted to put in its beak, but then it looked like a um, prom queen or a beauty pageant contestant. So I'm going to go ahead and use um, hold uh, my my phone, which you guys I don't know if you guys know I use my iPhone, so I will get you a better look. But yes, look at that. 
And I apologize for the shakiness. Like I said, I do not know. I apologize for the shakiness. But here we are. Through the body. And I will hopefully have some better pictures to show at the end of the video. So here is where I used the doily die. And yes, this thing is almost three feet long. Just the tail. Let me pull back. The tail is just is about three feet long. But check that out. Yes, I was crazy. And if you guys have seen my um, video of my craft room, I have this chalk painted hutch. And this is where I took everything out because I was, I'm reorganizing my craft room to um, to just reset it and show off the amazing things people have sent me. And there is the Merry Christmas banner. And it's just this long paper. And I just hand wrote that Christmas with um, a blue one of the blue um, markers that I had. In retrospect, I might have made it um, too big, but like I said, so I have my uh, my peacock sitting. Hopefully, the my video is showing the catching the shimmer on this. But look at that, layer upon layer. Oh, and also, the not only did I do the top part, top part, but I also did the bottom of it, the underneath, so I did the entire thing. I truly do not know how many coffee filters I use. In retrospect, I could have probably bought the doilies, but it was just awesome. I wanted to create everything. This is literally created from scratch. It's a good thing I have a, we have a Kruig, so I don't have to worry about running out of coffee filters now. So here you can see all of the feathers. And look, this is my hand, so you guys can see the, the size of this thing. Like I said, I do apologize for the shakiness of the video. I don't know how I would be able to record this without having to move it around. And I use so much hot glue on this thing. Here is the beacon, here is the crystal, and it's just on its side. I had it flat, but it looked better that way with the silver filigrees. If I can get a little closer look. Hopefully, that yeah, that's catching the, the shimmer on that. So yes, look at that, oh my goodness. So, yes, I am a little crazy, and I had to make this. It's either that, or I might get arrested for stealing one from, from, from work. But I really wanted to make this. So let me know what you guys think, and I'll go ahead and link everybody's uh, the link to everybody's video here in the description. And Tamika, thank you so, so much for inviting me. I feel super honored that you guys actually include me, and I feel like one of the cool kids. I do apologize, because I haven't made many videos, but um, I have a few things coming up. And I hope you guys are all having a wonderful time. I hope you guys are all enjoying your Christmas decorations and putting everything together. Um, thanks again for stopping by, you guys. Uh, leave a comment, and all you guys will be entered into the all the comments will be entered into the um, giveaway for the One Little Dreamer Zibit Shop gift card. So let me just pan out one more time. And once again, thank you guys. So head on over to Sweet Crafty Chicks videos uh, channel. That will be the next link here on the uh, description. And again, you guys, thank you so, so much. Uh, Merry Christmas to everybody, and I hope you guys are having a great time crafting. Bye, everyone.